Today I got my uh, 16 terabyte NAS in from Seagate. It uh, came in UPS. It's kind of sort of unboxing, but not really. As you can see, it says uh, recertified. Why brand? Why why buy brand new when you can buy used and make sure it's already fixed? Okay, so got the power brick cord for the power brick. This get pamphlet. <clears throat> Nick card, now I mean Nick uh, cable. Key, which comes in handy, surprisingly. I don't think I can get this out with one hand. Um, we'll see here. There we go. Smaller than I thought. Anyways, there she goes. I have to do a close-up review um, in a little bit here you go back and everything like that this is a 16 terabyte version drives install inside must be locked but I'll do a close-up review later on okay here it goes the NAS with a uh, I got in the mail today. Here you can see there are four drive bays. Each drive is four terabytes for a total of 16. Um, these are recertified drives, also. They are, yeah. Not low end, but not the highest end either. They're not anything to write home about for sure. But uh, you got one USB 3, two activity lights, disk activity, power, the LED, USM slot. I'm gonna, I'm not sure if I'm gonna like that or not. Anyways, locking mechanism. They sent me a nifty little key too, thank you. Thought I wouldn't get that at all. It's a huge fan in the back. You can actually take it off and replace it with one you want. I, I don't know if I'll do that. It depends on how loud it's going to be. Um... I don't anticipate that much activity on it, but we'll see. Two up to 1,000 NIC ports, USB 3, power, reset. Um, you can take these and uh, run them concurrent. Um, I don't know how much speed you'll get over them, but they if you do run them concurrent, concurrent they have a fault you know so if one fault one fails it'll still run if you have one plugged up and then it fails you just yeah it doesn't do anything until you plug it up to the other one now I don't know how that works yet I'm gonna be setting it up here in a little bit and seeing how it works but as of right now I think we're gonna run both just to see if there's any speed 
any performance boost, but I don't anticipate much, if anything. We'll just see how it goes. But there you go. 16 terabyte NAS, Seagate recertified.